Hey guys, welcome to this video. Today we are going to learn something in JavaScript, okay? We're going to know how to check if a checkbox, an input of the type checkbox, is checked or if it is marked in our HTML, okay? So here I have an HTML file, linking a script file, and we need just to and we just need to create our form, okay? So I will create a very simple formulary to just put our input of type checkbox. And we need also to define some properties like the ID. I can put terms maybe. This depends on what we are feeling with this information. And we can have a label to describe what this checkbox means, okay? So here we can put terms and this is related to the name of the form. So I put also terms in the name attribute and we can put agree with the terms, okay? So if the user check this checkbox, he or her will agree with our website term. So let's open this in our browser. We will see only the checkbox, okay? And we want to identify when this is checked or not, okay? So this can be done with pure JavaScript. I will switch here to my file. And the first step is to select the element. So we can use a variable with let or const doesn't matter, but we need to check that checkbox. So I will use document, here selector, can okay, use. And here we put that ID that is terms, okay. And we have access to a property called check it, okay. So if checkbox dot check it is true we have our checkbox marker check it if and if it the response of this is false it is not checked okay so let's save this and see what the console log gives to us so here we have the false the boolean false so it means that we don't check it that checkbox the user don't check it and how can we see if it works with the checkbox checked? Simple. We can just put the attribute checked here. And now our response will be true because we are forcing the checkbox to be checked. Okay. So as you can see here in the HTML in the browser, we see the checkbox marking. Okay. And here in the console, this is also true. So we can do a conditional with this like if checkbox check it you can uh, set a comment maybe console log the checkbox checkbox is checked so this is where you put your logic your other programming statements to do another thing, what you want with the checkbox second, okay? So, as you can see here, we have the print of this line in the console log. And if we remove that attribute here and save the file, now we don't have because the checkbox is not checked, okay? So guys, this is it, very simple. We just need to verify this property here. All of the checkbox inputs has this property, so you just need to see which boolean will return by this hood, and you have your result and can do what you want. Okay, so you can help me to grow this channel by subscribing and liking this video. This will help me a lot, and hope you enjoy. See you in the next one.